Hi, my name is Brittany and my partner Beth and I are Xavier University graduate occupational therapy students and today we will be giving you a tutorial on how to use the IntelliKeys USB keyboard. IntelliKeys is a universal keyboard designed for anyone with a physical, visual, or cognitive disability who may have difficulties using a standard keyboard. With its many setup features, this keyboard can be customized to fit any individual's needs. It is nicknamed the keyboard with a changing face for its many overlay options that will be discussed in this tutorial. Before using IntelliKeys, you must download the software program, which can be downloaded on a Windows or a Mac computer. After installed, there is one cord to plug the IntelliKeys into the computer. Plug the USB end into the system unit, and the other end of the cord goes into the back of the keyboard. Now you can set the IntelliKeys in front of the computer screen, and we will demonstrate the features. We will start by inserting the QWERTY overlay, which is the standard keyboard. As you can see, when my fingers brush over the keys, the letters are very sensitive. And then if I hold my finger down on the key, it repeats itself until I let go. This can cause problems for someone with decreased motor control or tremors. There is a setup overlay that allows users to change the response rate and repeat option that we will demonstrate now. Currently the response rate is at 15. We will change it to be at a slower response rate of 8. The lower the number that you choose, the longer you have to hold your finger on the key for it to respond. We will also turn the repeat option off. Now that these changes have been made, I am able to brush my fingers on the keyboard without the keys responding as quickly. When I want to choose a letter, I must hold it for a second before it responds. If I hold it too long, the key no longer repeats because we turn that feature off. There are other features that you can change using the setup overlay. These include turning off the key sound volume, turning the smart type on or off, and adjusting the speed of the mouse. You can change the speed of the mouse by choosing a lower number for it to go slower or a higher number for it to go faster. Now, you're probably wondering what smart type is. This feature helps eliminate keystrokes by predicting the next letter or adding a space after a punctuation mark. As you can see here, as I type in a Q, it automatically types in the letter U and then adds a space after the period. So far we have shown how the setup overlay can be used, but this keyboard comes with six other overlays to help you access the computer that we will explain now. The QWERTY overlay is in standard keyboard format. It has mouse arrows and functions that are on the bottom right, and it also includes numbers 0 through 9. Next is the alphabet overlay. This overlay presents larger keys that are in alphabetical order. These keys are all in lowercase and are easy to read. Next is the basic math overlay. It works just like a calculator and presents with numbers 0 through 9. It also includes math functions on the top right, such as addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. The basic writing overlay features keys in a QWERTY format, numbers 0 through 9, and other basic key functions. The web overlay has the same format as the QWERTY overlay, but at the very top of the page, this overlay provides keys for web page access. The final overlay is the computer mouse. This includes arrows to move the cursor in all directions on the computer screen. It also has the option to left click, click and drag, double click, and single click. An additional piece of equipment that you can purchase to use with the IntelliKeys keyboard is a key guard. This is placed on top of the keyboard and has holes that you insert your finger in to activate the key. This allows the user to rest their hand on the keyboard without the keys being activated and increases the user's accuracy of choosing a letter. This is the end of our tutorial of IntelliKeys USB keyboard.